<laughs> just shaking the camera. I don't like that that's attached to this, like the camera, because it shakes so much. This is what happened to the last one. <laughs> Stop judging me. <clears throat> yeah. I was cleaning up the area. I was picking up this paper and didn't know that somebody left the gold lid off. And when I tore the paper off, the, the little canister fell off this table onto the table with this. And it just <laughs> all over it. But it still looks kind of cool. I think I'm going to do some graffiti on here. Make it a fun piece. But I think it's crazy how it's still laced. Like if you could see that. It's pretty cool. So I'm going to do this one again. What resin was that? But I'm going to use spray paint. This is this. We use this one. We're, that's what we're going to use right now. Countertop epoxy. See how that goes. <clears throat> but on this one I'm using flat white I'm not a fan of this paint to paint with so we're going to try to see what it looks like in resin it's sugar it's a graffiti paint um, dark teal a little bit lighter teal it'll be fun and then some rust-oleum satin apple red and instead of gold we're going to try this mirror effect da, da, so, da. This should be fun it actually works this stuff actually works we uh we put it on a piece of uh glass and uh it actually made a mirror effect on it you have to use the whole thing i we barely have any left <clears throat> also this is a great example of when I mess up. It looks like this. Why, why do they say pour the hardener first? It just does. But, but it doesn't make sense. Why? What does it matter? Just follow the instructions. And you know what? This is kind of cold. What do you want to do? <laughs> Stick. 
So I tried to do a something, and I can't remember what it was. It was a long time ago. But I used um, Resi Blast in it. This is not a good example of what Resi Blast does. This is an example of me making a mess. Um, but there are pits in it because Resi Blast tends to do that. When you have pits, you need to sand it down and then get give it a good coating of oh god alcohol. Damn it! How do we fix that? <laughs> Scrape it into here. <clears throat> this canvas is just it's jinx. the devil's work. Just scrape it off and then we'll wipe it down with alcohol. All right. Okay, alcohol's right there. Use the, uh, yeah, you can use that one. No, use this one. This is, this was full of alcohol. Oh. <laughs> I've never done that. I know. This and I'm kind of glad that it wasn't warmed up because it probably would have all came out. Yep. No bueno. But Alcohol cures everything resin Miss Happy. Miss Happy? I need to scry over. Scry. Cry over spilt resin. Right. Sorry for the movement. We have that attached to the table and this table shakes. I'm holding it. It's on wheels. I make it's a, magic. Uh, Separate make stand. A, a new table. See this? This is a Resi Blast dimple. Move yourself. Right there. You can see it. Yeah, there's a beom, couple. Beom, beom. Beom, there's beom. pits and shit too. But we sanded it down and we're, <coughs> we put um, <laughs> something. We sanded it down and put a whole bunch of alcohol on it and I just put more alcohol on it. Reuse. You can get it from anywhere, but we use 91%. So Man. Do you want to put those in warm water? We probably should. Look at that. So thick. That's what she said. Yeah. You were thinking that. Yeah, but you said Yeah, so if you guys have uh, been watching, we've been doing uh, more and more countertops. We just did that bar. Let us know what you think. If you have any comments or... Um, just a don't point blank. You know, leave them in the... Below, all that fun stuff. Um, and if you want to see how we do it, just click just right there. Doink, doink, doink. And uh, we'll show you. Okay, We're going to put this in some warm water. Just for a minute. Just for a minute. Warm these guys up. Pull the bar. Also, we need to think about what we're going to mess around and we need to think about how we're going to do our challenge pour as well for our Facebook group. Yeah, I want to do that. The, the challenge pour, the colors are amazing. This, this, uh, 
I don't know if you guys are on Facebook and if you like to participate in like challenges and stuff, but we are part of this Facebook group, Fluid Art Community with Susanna mm, Danks. Donks? I'm not sure. I'm so horrible with, you know, all the things, e science. And so, but she is an amazing artist as well. She's got a YouTube channel. You should totally check her out. You probably have already seen her videos, but she's brilliant. She does tests and all that sort of fun stuff, just like we do. Look at that. I can't. Your hands. Are I mean, it's like you would think that it was setting up or something. Is that how it's been? That's it's a little better. Yeah, it's getting thinner. That's the thing with this new resin is just. Man, that is like super it's thick. It's super thick. I don't even know if that if that's helping it. It seems like it's helping it in this. That's oh. way thinner. This is a different story. Just let it sit there for a minute. Don't be impatient. Oh. Show them the other ones that we, the other 10 by 10 while we're waiting. Well, I, they've already seen them, I'm pretty sure. They've seen them wet. We have a how-to on this one as well. Um, you can... Doink, doink. Oh, doink, 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 doink. Right there. Um, see how we did this one? I love doing the gold marble. So much fun. Super classy. And this... This was really one of the first times that we had a problem with. Uh, we didn't prep this canvas. Yeah, we didn't prep it. So you could see that it kind of went towards the center. So all this is raw on the sides. But it still gives it so much motion. I mean, I don't mind it. It looks really good. We still got to put another coat over it. Um, but if you want to see how to prep a canvas um, so it doesn't do this. Dunk, dunk, dunk. There you go. <laughs> Um, so yeah. Doink, doink, doink. Doink, doink, doink. <clears throat> doink, doink, doink. And. And make sure you guys go and vote for your favorite one. We've I decided to adjust it a little bit. We were going to do whoever has the, like, whichever one of these has the most votes, that's when we're going to give away. But now it's whichever one you voted for with your entry. This is the one we're going to give away. So if you really like this one, we're going to stick you with this one and vice versa. Yeah. So. If you haven't uh, voted yet. Yeah, go vote right here. Doink, doink, doink. Doink, 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 doink. I say that plenty of time, and if it's still. The. Uh, I don't know what to say. Well, the hardener is. I know. Mm, not bad at all. Um, okay. That's what I was thinking. So the hardener thinned out and the resin didn't do much. Also, shout outs to all of our new viewers. All of our subscribers, thank you all so much for all the wonderful comments, all the everythings that you guys leave us beautiful words to wake up to in the morning. We try to answer every one of them as soon as you leave a comment. But you know, when you have your hands in resin, sometimes it takes a minute. We can't promise when we hit the 100,000, you know. Can't promise we'll answer all of them. <laughs> we will. When we get our... Silver button or bronze? I don't know. Silver. It's a silver button. He's I'm obsessed. I want the silver button. Damn it. Yeah, that's a lot thinner. So what's our plan for this one? Is it going to be a puddle? No, I, Is it going to be? I don't. I don't. Don't. Just, I just <laughs> every time you do that, it it messes with my head and my ADD kicks in and. Um, it sounds like a plan you're spilling. Let's play it by ear. It'll be amazing. 
Oh. I need to show the people how Big Red turned out. Where's my trash can? I need my trash can. So we have no idea how this is gonna turn out because <clears throat> we haven't used spray paint uh, with this resin. So hopefully. Be a new experiment day for y'all. Be fun. I'll only do that in case I need to make more resin. All right. While you're doing that and then shaking the table, I'm gonna show them big red. Oh, yeah. So, let's see. Come over here. Turned out pretty awesome. We weren't sure if it was going to survive the breakdown, but it did. All of the sparkle that's in it is not glitter. It's from the Jacquard pigment paste. And I'm 92% sure that that's where all the lacing came from as well. 92. Yep. E-science. It still looks like a rose to me. But I can see how Jeff would not want it to look like a rose since guy stuff, etc. And it's for a male client of ours. I'll lean it on that. There we go. I don't know where Moo went. Moo Pup. There he is. Hi, Moo. You being precious? I know it. Oh, I'm way ahead. Also, the pot life in this is not amazing. You got to get it out as soon as you can. Or that was just a product of using. What do you want me to spray all the colors in? Um, shit, I forgot about that. There's the cups right there. No, but it's the last of the cups. Did you shake these yet? I need to take this damn bracelet off. I always get resin in it. I like to put this all over the clear or whatever color the base normally is just to let the let, so the resin just spreads a little easier and it starts to sell out before um, or not sell out before but it just starts working smoother <clears throat> right. I'm gonna do a little bit see how this works so far so good This is the white Rust-Oleum something, flat white primer. Focus, focus. It's not going to focus. There it goes. I don't like this color. What is that? Oh, this is the dark one. That's why. Nope, this is the light one. What? Do you want me to ask this dark one? No. This is the, the red. I can just go like that. That looks great. 
color he's using right now is by Sugar. It's full throttle. Sorry. Yep. Next oh. color is Man, that is terrible. Giggles by Sugar. Do you want a different color? Man, that is just Tell me. I'll go pull like a transparent teal. No, let's just try it. Like you barely need any. Like, geez. Spray paint definitely works better than acrylic paint in this. The red that we're using Ooh, that is, is some red. Apple red and satin by Rustoleum. dot in there. Ooh, it looks beautiful in the cup. I bet this does what the original Rustolian Gold should do. It do. Whoa. Huh. It doesn't do anything to this. Unless it's just not mixing. <laughs> Look at that. Do you want more? Maybe a, a little bit more. Alright, you guys. Check this out. This is the mirror. Super fun. Oh, yeah. It's starting What's to get warm. Oh. Is that my... No. Is that something? Yeah. Let me pull this out. Oh. Where did that come from? Probably when you picked up a cup from over there. Ooh, that red is mixed. Here, you're going to have to mix it in more. What? Just spray paint. Oh, that's just raw spray paint. <laughs> Put a different color on it. All right, I'm gonna move the just spray paint. Look at that. That is crazy. Huh? Oh man, this should be interesting. That looks crazy. Do you have your heat of ready? I don't have it. I didn't get it. So it appears that the Acrylic paint is what really messes with the pot life of something, this brand of resin. So as long as you're using a thinner paint like a spray paint, an ink, or probably even a pigment powder, if you just use a little bit, it it's fine. Also, this is the 
silver that's in it is the Rustoleum Mirror Effect. It's a small can. Fire! I wouldn't torch that for too long because it's raw. And you know what? Yeah. So we've gone over what fire does, but if you're new, fire pops the bubbles that gets mixed into your resin when you're adding part A to part B. I'm kind of excited to tilt this. Um, I'm excited to see it too. I'm going to take these business cards before they get resin. I'm really digging that dark and that silver. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> we got to move all this stuff. We got to move all this stuff. Move all of it. Mm. Bring you guys out for this. Oh my god, there. Oh god, look at that silver. Is it red. thick? Oh, yeah. That looks bananas. Look at that. Wow. Look how gnarly that is. Why does it look wavy like that? It, in the recording, it looks like you could touch it. I brought you a straw. Oh, here it is. Blink, 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 blink. Just blow it. The red is so. This gradation between the blue and the silver to roll off looks awesome. Look how crazy that looks. Like this waviness right here. That silver and that teal. It's creating like weird freckles and it's not like, like it's still level, but it looks textured almost. And this lacing is crazy. Like it's starting to lace. Where's, I wanna do some. At. Used them to pull the pins out of a piece. <clears throat> that's, oh, that's a paste. paste. There is a white one though. I haven't done this method in a hot, hot minute. Oh my god, that stuff is like everywhere. This makes me want a steak. For some reason. Are you guys, technically, you should wear 
a respirator when using micas because it's not the best for your innards. God, it is like everywhere. I know. Looks like a fairy farted in here. <laughs> no, all right. I'm laughing my own joke. Adding this dust to the top just gives it an extra sheen since none of the colors really were metallic and you know we like our sparkle. Um, other than the mirror, it just adds an extra layer of sparkle over top of it. Gives a little bit and of it sells. dimension. I think you what's selling, selling, I think that's the Look white. At that. It's not. Look at oh, that. I see it. <clears throat> that's why I wanted to do this and then I wanted to. Don't ruin it. On it's camera, stretching. it almost looks like America. It's like all red, white, and blue. Yeah. It reminds me of a melted bomb pop. <gasps> can we call this one bomb pop? That would be great. Okay, you no, guys. We'll just call it Americana. Americana bomb pop? Summertime Americana. God, look at those cells. I know. It It's grabbing the pigment powder that we just put on it, and because of surface tension and other science terms, um, it's pulling it into cell. So it's That's like true. sparkle with a clear under. Undertone? Under? I don't know. You trying to help surface tension over there? I mean, you can make them bigger. Watch. <laughs> I don't want to. Now it looks like a gunshot wound. That's great. This is a great piece, B. You did a good jobbing. If you want to mess with a cell, do it on this side. Mm -hmm, that's good. I'm going to leave it. Good work, B. I'm a fan. Can't wait to see how this one sets. Anyway, since our computer is doing the most with the uh, countertop video, I'm just going to upload directly from the phone. Are you taking it under there? Yeah. You're going to take it to our super secure. Mm -hmm. um, we call it Fort Knox. Yeah, the dust-free zone, the Thunderdome in the basement. The, the, instead of dust-free zone, it's called the dusty zone. <laughs> Dumb. Anyways, it's under there. This for the evening. Anyways, thank you all for watching, for liking, subscribing, etc. If you have any questions comments anything post below thank you for all the donations and the love from all you fine fine people it keeps our dream alive to work and live off of our work it's um, so messy why are you showing these people this mess because it's an art studio it's supposed to be messy that's what we do here mess anyways see y'all manana cut